Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to Yak Nasty. Hey guys, Pup T here from Yak Nasty. Uh, as you saw in this week's video, we headed out to Land Between the Lakes to try to uh, locate, find, see the Land Between the Lakes Sasquatch, Yeti, Werewolf, whatever you want to call them. Um, as you can tell, we had no luck out there. Um, hey, you know, we are looking for a Yeti. They don't just come out and say hello, you know. But we also had to cut our trip a little short due to a family emergency. But that's all taken care of and, and going well. Hey, but another thing is we've been promising you for probably the past month, two months, um, to do a product review. So today, I'm going to do a product review. Um, this product is the Fraybill Crawler Can. All right, I got this from Farm and Fleet online. It was on sale. It was like twelve bucks. Uh, I was at a Farm and Fleet in Illinois. Saw it on sale. Um, Should have picked it up. Would have saved me the shipping and whatnot. But all, all in all, I think it cost me like seventeen bucks. But let me tell you. This is a great, great product. If you use night crawlers, um, mealworms, anything like that, this product works. And all you do, undo the top. As you can tell, I'll be using it. Put your night crawlers in the top, and then at the bottom. You put ice in there. Keeps them cool. Um, I, I'll tell you, the last time I, I used this, which was this weekend, but prior to that, about two weeks prior to that, I bought 36 Red Worms, Canadian night crawlers, whatever they were. And I just opened up the little blue bin, threw them in here, threw some ice in there, went fishing. If you know, if you got that blue little container and you go out fishing, if it's if it's hot, if it's humid out there, you got about 20 minutes to use 18 night crawlers before they're just dead. With that product there, I literally use however many I'm going to use. You know, I break them in halves, break them in thirds, whatever. Throw them out there, fish my for my little bluegill, whatnot. Whatever I have left, I come home, empty out the ice into the sink or into the yard, whatever. Close it up. I put that whole container in the fridge. I I had for two weeks, you know, I don't even know how many night crawlers in there because I, I had bought 36 total. And I probably had probably a dozen left um, at the end of this weekend when I went out to uh, land between the lakes with Bakey Poo um, I mean the, the product is amazing I mean for 12 bucks it yeah it's kind of big you know what I mean but if you if you on a kayak and you want a place to put some worms put your worms in there put some ice it, it doesn't have to be freezing cold of course it just needs to be cooler than than what the outside is so you don't lose um, your night crawlers you know for three bucks you buy your night crawlers and, and you can really keep them as long as you want uh, this weekend put some ice in it went out went out on the kayaks fish for a little bit came back uh, I ended up throwing this into a igloo cooler with ice in it threw it in there took it out the next day dumped out whatever water or ice was left put some new ice in there went out to Dyer Creek you know put some new ice in there whatnot it was good to go I ended up just setting the worms free find a new nice cool spot where the ground was a little moist so they could get away and you know add to the population or whatnot but I'm telling you guys that that product the Fraybill crawler can is worth the money take a look at it 
purchase it if you want. Not, you know, I ain't got no say so over nothing. But I couldn't find it on Amazon at the time, or I think I could find it on Amazon for like $25. Looked on Farm and Fleet. I found it for 12 bucks. Like I said, I think it was 17 with shipping and handling. But but look on eBay, look on all those spots. Number one product if you if you're out there using night crawlers, if, if you ask me. You know. So that's a product review from Pub T here, Yak Nasty. Stay tuned. I don't know how this week's gonna go as far as uh what we're gonna do for our, our next week's video or whatnot. I got my younger kids coming back again. So hopefully I get them out there fishing. We'll do some videos with them. Blakey Pooh's going to Arkansas. Maybe we can get Nate Dog to come out. You know, but he's out there doing his army thing. But upcoming videos, I have something real special for you guys. Something that I don't think anybody's done as far as out looking for creatures that are in your area or mythical creatures that may or may not exist we got a good one coming for you all right it's gonna be pretty awesome hopefully i can get it done within the next two weeks but as always guys like comment share please subscribe and if you do share this video please share it on your social media your facebooks instagrams whatever twitter we really appreciate it we love y'all stay tuned